Welcome to QB Film Room. Today we're taking a look at uh, Upper Iowa University, their quarterback situation um, as it stands entering the 2016 Northern Sun Intercollegiate Conference season. Upper Iowa is a Division II school, and they return a guy by the name of Dimitri Morales. He's a senior. Um, he's from California, and he's 6'2", 210, transferred from the junior college route to Upper Iowa last year, immediately earned the starting job for uh, Upper Iowa University. Uh, now, Morales, I watched quite a bit of him on tape last year, so I have a pretty good idea of who he is as a player. Frankly, I'm uh, shocked that he didn't go Division I. Okay, he, he is that good of a player, and he made his presence felt immediately uh, you know, upon arrival. Uh, very, very athletic guy. Okay, Very intuitive, instinctual out there in terms of running the football. A great running threat. Uh, strong arm. And within that spread Upper Iowa attack where uh, their offensive coordinator, Ben Curran, likes to get the ball out of his quarterback's hands quickly, there's multiple options for him to pick from pre-snap. So there's a lot placed um, on Morales in terms of up here, in terms of making the correct pre-snap decision uh, to throw the ball to the correct person. But uh, he returns. He has a strong arm. There's a few weak areas of his game. Uh, one being, uh, you know, sometimes he, you know, you know, he doesn't throw on time uh, within the short game. So there, there were multiple instances where he's not getting the ball out of his hand fast enough. And that's a byproduct of him being so athletic, wanting to extend the play and survey until the last possible second. So that's an area that, you know, I would like to see improvement on in 2016. Uh, but uh, he has a chance to be the best quarterback in that conference this year. Their backup guy is a uh, sophomore by the name of Brent Lammers, who returns uh, to the team this year. Now, last year, he stepped in for Morales when Morales got hurt. And he performed really well. That's another recruit that uh, Shea and company were able to get locally, in fact. He uh, played his high school ball at uh, West Delaware, which isn't too far from Fayette, down there in Northeast Iowa. But this guy, Lammers, uh, in watching him on tape, natural thrower of the football. Probably a more natural thrower than even Morales is. Brett Lammers is a kid who spins it with ease. He's an easy thrower. And he can throw with touch and great ball placement down the field. Okay, He has a sense of uh, where to throw the ball down the field. And uh, he can throw off multiple foot platforms. So, for instance, if Lammers is rolling or he is forced to abort the pocket, he can throw at the snap of a, of a finger and still be accurate off of any sort of foot platform. So the future is bright for Lammers at Upper Iowa. Um, he's going to probably end up being a two-year starter after Morales graduates. But uh, they've got those two guys who they feel real good about. And then they got a, uh, a young kid by the name of Freidhoff is his last name, who I don't know much about. But uh, that's sort of the baseline of, of Upper Iowa's quarterback situation heading on into this season. Uh, just to recap, we've got uh, Dimitri Morales, who essentially is, is a poor man's version of Jeremiah Masoli. Not as big as him, obviously, but uh, a guy who I was really impressed with last year. Saw play live um, in October when Upper Iowa played Concordia St. Paul, and that was probably his best performance of the season. So look for a growth in year two of that system, and uh, they got a guy waiting in the wings in Lammers who they feel real good about. Brian Trulin here, QB Filmer.